When PWSA receives a new request for a dye test certification, our review can sometimes determine that a new dye test is required. In this case, you'll be notified by email that additional steps are required before we can issue a certificate of compliance. Within the email, click on the link to navigate directly to your application in PWSA's new online permitting system. After you navigate to your application in the online permitting system, you'll see several initial steps that you need to take to begin the dye test process. First, at the bottom of the screen, download any maps provided by PWSA staff and provide them to your plumber. It's important to remember that a licensed plumber must be used to complete all dye tests. On the left-hand side of the screen, click the Start link underneath the new dye test required step. This will create a new record in the permitting system that allows you to upload the results from the plumber's dye test. After clicking the Start link, you'll be taken to a new record in the permitting system where you'll be able to record the results of the dye test once it's completed. On the first page, you'll see a list of dye test requirements that the plumber will need to follow. Additionally, you'll have the opportunity to download a copy of the dye test results form and provide it to your plumber so that they can use this to record the results. At the bottom of this page, you'll need to indicate that you have read and agreed to these requirements. Once your plumber completes the dye test, you'll be able to navigate back into the permitting system. Click on the Submit Completed Dye Test step on the left side of your screen and fill out some basic information to submit the dye test results. You'll need to record the plumber name, the date the dye test was performed, and upload a copy of the completed dye test results form. Once PWSA staff receives all of this information, we'll complete your application and issue you a certificate of compliance that you'll be able to download via email. As always, if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to contact us, and we would be happy to help.